after you hit subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell as well as stay tuned at the end of the video for the question of the day. Let's go! Maybe that title is just a tish bit harsh, I guess you would say. If it is, just let me know, but... <laughs> What's going on, my fellow folks? Books? Zop of the Circle here, and I'm back with another video just to educate my people. Okay, so there's just some things that, you know, I've been wanting to talk about over the past couple of years, I guess you could say. And that's the good old job that I've had, you know, overnight while doing this good old thing that we call YouTube. Bye. And, you know, it's the same job that I've had pretty much for the duration of this channel thus far. And it's just, uh... You know, like, um, whenever you wake up each day and regardless if you're having a good day or a bad day, you know that eventually that day is just going to put you in this super dreadful environment that you really don't want to be in. And it just kind of makes your entire day go to crap and it just, it makes you feel so like bad on the inside because you know that at the end of each day you have to go through this routine where you're just like, ah, I just want this stuff to be over with and I just want to do something that I actually like and stuff like that because it is very physically draining to just go into that environment day in day out and just it's not just physically draining it's mentally exhausting and I know that it has like a dampening like whenever I get home because of course whenever I get home I just want to lay down and not do anything because I'm just physically and like just internally exhausted and I just don't want to move and I just lose all the will to live and it's just something that just creates a very depressing day flow because it's like when you wake up everything is all hunky-dory but the closer you get back to going to that event it just sort of kind of dwindles down and of course there are options but they're not very concrete options option number one just get a new job now around here this is a very small town this is a very like rural town like there's not a whole lot of industry around here so there's not a whole lot of jobs around there's like fast food this place that i work at that's pretty much it like either it's a fast food chain or it's retail there's no like in between and that really sucks because aside from the job that i have all the other jobs around they just pay significantly less and so that's why i have you know applied for other jobs but they just kind of don't meet the same requirements Question number two, why don't I just, you know, become a full-time artist? Now, believe me, I have thought about that because based on my current workflow, I get paid at my job about $60 a day. And with my current commission prices and my skill level, that would mean I'd have to do three commissions daily in order to sustain the same amount of cash flow. Now, that's not a bad thing to do because I can do that no if, ands, or buts. If, you know, my actual night job wasn't a thing and I could devote myself entirely to, you know, being an artist. With that being said, the only bad thing is that I would need a steady stream of commissioners. The reason why I know that I don't is because even on like a normal day, whenever I clear my commission queue, I'll get like, you know, one or two commissioners that one day, but then no one else in like as the week progresses. And that's one of the things that just kind of sits and dawns on me because I'm like, I wanted to take that risk and just try to be a full-time artist, but I would need like a concrete stream of commissioners. And also, you know, if I had the time to fill my commission queue and then clear it because I really love drawing, like it's not something that I have exhausted myself on. I could do that like full-time and love it and enjoy it. And then in addition to that, I'll be able to push more content for you guys because I have more time to think, I have more time to plan, I have more time to actually record. But of course, I would need, I would still need those three commissioners every single day. Oh man, or if I was just to get like a batch of commissions every week and then just kind of get those cleared out. Either way, it's just something that I've, you know, been thinking about. And yes, I am still working on that because that is something that I am in pursuit of. Because, like, once I get to that point and I know it's, like, steady and I can rely on it, and you know, I can, you know, dedicate myself to doing that, then I can do move that one step forward and actually start doing that full-time. You know, being a full-time artist, full-time YouTuber and stuff like that. 
and like the art would pay the bills and then you know everything would be all well and good i'd be working from home which is the dream it's right there in front of me but i can't grab it and it just Ah, oh, it frustrates me, and then every night I still have to go to this current job, and that frustrates me even more, and then dealing with all those people, and then management, and all that stuff, not making up their mind, and having to do all these extra things that just make you want to tear yourself apart. I also failed to mention that whenever I had to take Babby to the hospital, they didn't even wave the doctor's note. Like, what the crap, man, and like, super freaking exhausted, drinking all this caffeine, and the caffeine does not help me in any stretch of the imagination, because you guys know that I love me some good old caffeine, and now I'm not freaking sleepy, I'm exhausted, so the caffeine does nothing for me, and that just makes me feel like crap, and I love to freaking, oh my freaking god, it just, I will not rip my head off that was stuffing. I gotta get out of here, and I already know that the computer mic sounds like crap, but whatever, we're getting done. Just the people in my life in general, you guys and everybody else, it just, that's what's pushing me to keep going, because, you know, gotta support my family, gotta be here for my friends, and, you know, I've gotta keep on making content for you guys, because that is my own obligation I've made for myself. Huh. <sighs> So yeah, that's just something I had to get off my chest. Uh, but for right now, I'm going to go ahead and close this. As always, my name is Abba the Circle, and I'm out of here. La, 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 la. <laughs> Question of the day. Do you actually prefer the old intro song? Yeah. Or do you like the new intro song? Post your comments down there to Dibbly below and I'll share my thoughts with you guys. And I'll probably change it based on the majority vote. So yeah. <laughs>